Complete us. Oh, that's the last thing I need. And the suit must be cleaned on a cold wash. Do I make myself clear? As clear as clay. My assistant will pick it up tomorrow morning. Meanwhile, fill out the registration, Oppenbot, and take good care of the bag with the money. Apparently, only rabble work in this so-called hotel. Somebody works here? Excuse me, Inspector, but isn't that the bag with my plasma exchange whoopie do mammoth fur read, eh? Don't be silly, Oppenbot. The bags are identical. Yours is already in our room. And that's where I'm going to retire, now. I hope it isn't as shabby as the service here. Whew, close shave. I hate that stuck-up idiot. Better stay alert. He must be looking for gold. But at least I know where I can get that plasma exchange whoop de doo mammoth fur relay. Shards and more shards. What's he gonna do with all these shards? Aha! Uh -huh. Money! Here, this should work. Oh, that's nice and soft. Ha! Thank you. Whew, I can finally continue my journey. Here, take this. Huh? What's this? Your change. I didn't use it all. And now, off to new shores. Farewell, end times person. Hey, halt! Stop! Oh, great. He's gone. If I didn't constantly imagine things like that, I would probably be really worried now. Oh, that really is a bit rough. Wow, that even outdoes the pharmacy magazine of the blind drugstore owner. And that was in Braille. can find the craziest stuff in the trash. Huh, a pelican. That's not crazy. Mildly odd, maybe. Let's see if it appreciates me spicing things up a little. Don't mention it. There. Time for a break, herring breath. <laughs> That's what you get, bird brain. Ugh, slimy. Let's see if I can make something tasty out of it. Yeah, it consists entirely of fermented gas. Now all that's left are the scales. Dandruff in a bald man's hood. Ingenious. 
If there was such a thing as self-marriage, I would propose to myself. Could I bother you again? Yes, you seem to have a penchant for that. What are you doing again? I am preparing for my big speech. The world doesn't come to an end every day. I want to look good. I think you look just fine. Oh, you think so? Hmm. Maybe you're right. I... Oh, yeah. What is that? Oh, I have dandruff. This is a catastrophe. And I swapped all the hotel shampoo for cigarettes on the bright market. Don't just stand there. Do something. Shampoo? My salvation. Out with you. I have to shower. Ha <laughs> 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 The ghost is doing his haunting thing. I won't bother him now. The arrival of the destroyer is nigh. Ooga ooga ooga, Shally. The arrival of the destroyer is nigh. So nigh. Ooga ooga ooga, Shally. Ooga ooga ooga, Shally. Hey, I could really use a cork like this. <laughs> And you be a good boy, and stay in there, Mr. Toffee, okay? Mr. Toffee? <gasps> Where'd he go? in distress? What am I supposed to do? A fishing expedition? In there? You know, this is where I draw the... Oh, wait a minute. That is a toilet freshener. Oh, man. Who'd throw something that cool into a toilet bowl? Hello, reception? You are a dead man. I'm what? <laughs> Little joke. This is reception, of course. Always at your service, unless you're the guy stuck in the elevator. Elevator? I haven't seen an elevator here. Neither have I. That's why I can't help you. Please get off the line. Wait, I'm calling for my room. Well, well that's different then. What's your room number? Room 9. From the cursed room. Well, the most cursed. Why can't you just leave me alone? I've done everything you demanded. The old married couple, the friendly author, even the young actress, all dealt with. All right, I didn't put fresh sheets on your beds, but I have to draw the line somewhere. Uh, did I say room nine? Uh, of course, I meant room three. Ah, I finally got a hold of you. I've got a number of complaints about you here. Noise disturbance, odor disturbance, regular disturbance, molestation. Oh, no. Wait, those are about me. Whatever. More importantly, you still haven't paid for your delivery. Why do you need all those chickens anyway? Uh, did I say room three? Uh, of course, I meant room five. Really? You loser. Uh, how can I help you? 
I'd like to eat something. Ha! <laughs> You've got guts. I like that. Have you picked up your menu from reception? What? Is that necessary? What's the problem? Well, let's just say there are certain guests in your hotel that I would rather not run into. Oh, I know that problem. Happens to everybody, really. Can't you just recommend something? Sure, sure, I can't recommend something. Ugh. All right. Then just read the menu to me. No, that won't work. I have a very sensitive stomach. Besides, you have to sign a waiver for damage claims before you can even look at our menu. Oh, just forget it. I'll come up as soon as you're alone in reception again. Ah, that would be so nice. Can I do anything else to you? We urgently need fresh towels. Oh, then you're in the wrong hotel. We haven't had anything like that for years. Well, what am I supposed to take home as a souvenir? Uh, how about an infectious disease? Believe me, you'll remember us for years to come, provided the world hasn't ended by then. Can I do anything else to you? Tell me, you wouldn't happen to have a plasma exchange whoop de doo mammoth fur relay? Mm, it's possible. Wait a moment while I check in the basement. Hey, I can hear you breathing in the receiver. Mm, you caught me. Nevertheless, you still have to pay your bill for internal telephone calls. Can I do anything else to you? Oops. <laughs> Wrong number. No problem. That happens a lot. We think it's because of the electromagnetic radiation from the nuclear waste dump. Or the Indian burial ground. One of those. Hey, Bozo. Come on, please get dressed. Relieve me of the sight. I already told you. My clothes are in the laundry. And anyway, why should I? I'm telling you, you're gonna catch the whooping pox. Rubbish. My tongue would be completely blue. I would have a cough, the sniffles, and a fever. Blue tongue, cough, sniffles, fever. Got it. Ah, do whatever you want. Ugh. Sorry, I've got to go. Here, I got your clothes from the laundry. Now, please get dressed. Why should I? You must be freezing. <laughs> Not really. There's a draft from the holes in the window, but the putrid air from the heater balances it out. What if the heater goes out? Why don't you just tell me what you're planning? Then you won't have to constantly come up with some crazy scheme. Yeah, but where's the fun in that? I mean, where's the kick? Where's the challenge? The red modules are set to heat, but that's such a waste of energy. Let's see if I can turn them off. Rufus 1, Entropy 0. Ah, oh, rats, the coin is too big. What good is small change if it isn't small enough? That really is a bit rough. Maybe. Ha! It worked! Now that's what I call the inflationary use of bathroom humor. Yeah, finally! All this money changing has made me really hungry. I think I'll let Bozo go first.
Hi, you can never have enough pepper. <laughs> oh, don't panic. Oh, it all landed on the pie. And here we have a very special treat for the taste buds. <laughs> Eat my dust, all you uninspired, risk-averse cooks. Icing on the pie. It does cause a slight fever, but it's also good for your teeth. Oh, wait! It needs artificial coloring! Food must please the eye. What have you got there? Something to eat. What else? A pie? Hmph. Huh. That's really nice of you. Blah. This hotel slop isn't <coughs> very <coughs> tasty. On the contrary, I suddenly feel so... <coughs> How do I feel? Sick? Huh? I think uh, I have whoo! a fever. Is my tongue blue? Uh, yeah, like Doc on Barbecue Thursday when there's no more beer. No argument from me. Oh, no. It's the whooping pox, and I'm cold, too. You were right. I need to get dressed as quickly as possible. Could you maybe find my clothes? Ah, oh, the things you do for your friends. Here, I got your clothes from the laundry. Now, please get dressed. Yeah. Probably right. Thanks, Rufus. You really are a good friend. Told you so. Here's my towel. That brings us to phase three of my ingenious plan. I call it poetic injustice. Could I bother you again? Yes, you seem to have a penchant for that. What are you doing again? I am preparing for my big speech. The world doesn't come to an end every day. I want to look good. I think you look just fine. Oh, you think so? Hmm. Maybe you're right. I... Oh, yuck! What is that? Oh, my scalp itches! I have rice! Good thing I have this new Miracle Shampoo. And now, off with you! I have to shower. Arrival of the Destroyer is nigh. Ooga ooga ooga, Charlie. The arrival of the Destroyer is nigh. So nigh. Ooga ooga ooga, Charlie. Ooga ooga ooga, Charlie. There's a really funny joke here in the original German version. <laughs> Unfortunately, it got lost in translation. Home 
hum kumbaya. Our leader is now here. Tree tra tru la la. Shh. Ah, uh, right. Ah, uh, well, here I am now. <laughs> Let the party begin. <laughs> Does he bear the holy relics engraved with the insignia six? The what? Oh, the relics. Yeah, wait a minute. I just need to check that myself. <laughs> what, what sort of relics were those again? The holiest of sacred relics engraved with the insignia six. Here I go with my psychedelic lyrics about relics. They're so mad, they'll make your head ache. Yeah, you better call a med ache. You're gonna take a pill, or you're gonna get sick, for we are a sick addicted to the relics with the six insignia. Uh... What? Shh! Why? Didn't we agree on me having a rap solo? So, you want relics? All right, if that's all. One of the holy relics with the insignia six. One of the holy relics with the insignia six. Boom, waka, 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 waka. Shh. One of the holy relics with the insignia six. So what now? Not all the machines are running yet. Let the washing begin! What? Hey! I have to get out of the machine at the same time as Cletus's suit, preferably before I start to shrink. Choose the holy relic. Ritual dental operation. 
That's good. What? No, please, please stop! No, stop! Let's talk this over! Wait! Ah, I feel so dirty. Whatever. At least I got Cletus's clothes. <laughs>